The Red Balloon, Part 3 The preparations for the balloon adventure started immediately. Till tied a knot to keep the fresh air in the balloon and connected it to the basket with two ropes. There he was inside of his dream. He pulled hard on the ropes and in no time he was slowly floating up. The old lighthouse on his green island kept getting smaller and smaller and the blue sea became bigger and bigger. The seagulls flew excitedly over the water and watched the red dot in the sky until it disappeared out of their view. After a while, Till was surprised by a big dark cloud. They pushed themselves in front of him like a grey wall. The decision came in seconds. Rise! He had to fly higher! Above the clouds, the view was terrific. Till leaned on his basket and watched the grey spectacle. It was huge. But suddenly a small gap appeared in the sea of clouds. It looked like a green island in between. Was that a sign of fate? Till picked it up. He took his chance and sank with his red balloon through the cloud window. It was not very easy. The basket tipped from left to right. But Till made it. He flew his balloon safely through the grain and landed on a green meadow right next to a white house. Its huge window was framed in red. A very special person must live here, Till whispered. Till climbed out of the basket and went straight to the white front door. He knocked and waited. Till knocked again and called in a cautious voice. Hello! Did anyone hear his call? Did the door open? And who lived in that beautiful white house? Let's be surprised in part 4. Created in a white house. See you soon!